Aw, oh, yeah, this is the dance you do when you're finally done waiting six hours to log into the servers! <laughs> What's up, guys? This is Herc Duzik, and welcome to Helldivers 2. I am never going to close my game, because I have been waiting days to actually get into the servers. The login stuff has been terrible, but I finally got lucky today. I can finally play the game. Uh, please oh. keep moving through the training course at this time. I'm trying, trying to do an intro. But like I was saying, we did so much stuff on Pal Worlds, and I don't really know if there's much more that I could do that I want to share with you guys. And I noticed in the comments, tons of you guys were suggesting to check out Helldivers 2, and I was a little skeptical at first. As you guys know, I do so much Call of Duty stuff, but it's been a lot of fun to just kind of break away from that and try out some other games and do some new stuff, and it really has been paying off. The last couple of Pal World videos I did have like double or triple the views of the Call of Duty stuff, and I noticed it's bringing in so many more new subscribers. If you are new and you want to see some more random games and stuff like that on the channel, make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you're brand new to the channel. But I gotta be perfectly honest with you guys. I have no idea what this game is. I never played the first Helldivers. This is the sequel game. It's the second version of Helldivers, and I have no idea what this game is about. I just got to keep it real. I have no idea what I'm getting myself into today. But right now, we're in the tutorial section. We're doing the Helldiver training facility. We need to earn our cape, so let's go ahead and click E. Okay, so we have to check our map to find the facility. I think it's tab. Dude, that is a sick mini map, but when you sprint, it like goes away. Yeah, because I think you have to click Alt to do like a dive. <laughs> So I don't want to accidentally stop the recording on Shadow Play. <laughs> All right, yeah, we're almost here. This is the training facility. Hunter, hunt. I'm General, General Brach, Super Earth's oldest and most grizzled war hero. And I'm <laughs> Hell Diver training is the toughest test in the galaxy. But I can tell that doesn't scare you. No, sir, General, does not scare me. Yes, be impressed. Yes, enough yada yada. Let's go ahead and get through this. Oh, yes, I'm very strong. I'm, I'm getting to it. I, I won't let you down, General. I'm go. Oh, you gotta press C to crouch. Yeah, that's that seems pretty common. Let's go ahead and mantle that. Mantle that. Ooh, oh, we're sprinting now. Ooh, the movement is insane. Look at that. I'm already juking out these inanimate objects. But how do we jump? I've been clicking the spacebar. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, you hold it down. Oh, that's cool. Okay. But can you jump? Gotta dive. I'm gonna dive. I'm gonna dive for you, General. I got it. Ah! What? Oh, you can die in the tutorial. Okay, yeah, maybe, uh, maybe don't die here. Wait, how do you survive this? Oh, that's where you're supposed to dive. I see. Maybe you stay down, that way they can't shoot you. Double dive. Oh. Why did I immediately get up? Also, I just realized it says move through the highly realistic battlefield simulator. I feel like this game is almost like a parody. Like the fact that the general said that he's a grizzled war veteran or something like that. I feel like it's kind of satire, like it's not meant to be taken seriously. I really like the vibe of this game. Stay down. Very good. Okay. The mistake is I clicked shift. I kept sprinting. I just kept running into the sentry guns. Activate the battlefield injury simulator. Injury simulator? I mean, we just did that a second ago. Oh, dear God. Sweet liberty, the blood! <laughs> What's wrong with my character's voice? What are we, a Braden? All right, well, at least we can hit, use a stimmy. There we go. Right back into my neck. Beautiful. Oh, we're feeling good now. I wonder if we're going to run into paratroopers. This is a very realistic war scenario. We got the peacemaker. What's this? Uh, do I just shoot it? Why am I climbing over that? Don't do that. I need ammo. We got to reload. This game is pretty tactical so far, man. Look at that. There we go. It's dead. Use a grenade to close up that bug hole. Otherwise, oh, okay. All right, we got grenades. Holds G to quick throw a grenade. Well, sh we should probably line it up. There we go. All right, sweet. What a catapult of an arm! This is easy. Oh, that is a bunch. Wait, hold control to open the stratagem menu. Oh, you have to right, right up, and then you have to throw a stratagem ball. Okay. <laughs> what is this? How did I get that? Like, that's so cool. But oh dear, God. Wait, one of them survived. That was terrible. This tutorial section is awesome, though. Like, I feel like it's so well done. Helldivers fight in squads. Make sure no squad mates. Oh. Greetings, fellow Helldiver. What a fun <laughs> Greetings, Guardian. This is a cardboard cutout. How am I going to expect him to help? Oh, shit. Ah, they killed them. Squad mates can and will perish tragically all the time. <laughs> They're going to die all the time. Well, that's, that's great to hear. Okay, so we hold control. Up, down. These combos, dude. That's crazy. Now we throw a stratagem ball, and then we got another one. We're summoning a brand new buddy. Welcome. Greetings, fellow Helldiver. <laughs> Greetings again. Pick up the AR-23 Liberator. Okay, I got you. Click one, two, and three to switch between different weapons. Okay, that's sick. Got some extra ammo. Thank you. Extra grenades. 
Now, apparently you can switch to first person, but I don't know what the button is. I haven't seen anything in the settings that show your key binds. But maybe I'm just extremely dumb. Wait, oh, there it is. Change bindings. Duh. Switch aim mode. Oh, it's middle mouse? Wait, you have to click caps lock to talk? I change it to P. Oh, there we go. Okay, sweet. Oh, you can actually play in first person. That's awesome. <laughs> Why does it look like this, though? <laughs> Okay, so now it should actually remember that I want to aim in first person. That's pretty cool. If we switch to the pistol, yep, we're in first person. The aiming is kind of like, I don't know how to describe it. In the first person, it looks a little stiff, but it's not that bad. Better throw a grenade in there, right? Throw a grenade. Ow, shit! Die, spider. I... Nice, there we go. I'm doing it. I'm calling it a machine gun. Is this for me? I get a machine gun? Ooh! Button, button, button. There we go. <laughs> I love how interactive everything is, though. It's really cool. Retrieve the flag of Super Earth. You got it, buddy. So you can only use a pistol while you have the flag. Neat. Okay. Yeah, you're welcome for the cooperation. I know I know what I'm doing. Place it. Yes. This is for Super Earth. <laughs> you can salute to it. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, God, no. Eat grenades. Fire in the hole. Oh, I'm out of ammo. No. Get the machine gun. Oh, yeah. I'm good at this game. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, get a little reload. Oh, you actually can't move while reloading the machine gun. That's pretty sick. We're gonna get a cape. Yeah, give me the cape. I want the cape. Give me the cape. Give me. I did it. I beat the game. There you go. Hell Divers 2. That was the whole game. Let's celebrate. I love the diving. Honestly, that is one of the best dives. And look at that too. You can like dive and spin. Do a barrel roll. Yeah. Did I just do a barrel roll dive? Look at that. Woo! You can barrel roll dive. This game is amazing. Let's do it again. Ooh! Yes, put me in a pod. I'm ready to go pod hopping. See you later, General. Yo, honestly, we kind of look like Ethan from Infinite Warfare. But for real, this game does look pretty sick. I can't wait to see what we're actually going to do because honestly, I have no idea what this game is about. There it is, Helldivers 2, Merc Music Level 1 Cadet. I've seen a lot of stuff about this game, but I haven't really watched a lot of gameplay, so I don't know what we're going to be doing. Based off the tutorial, it looks like we're going to be capturing flags and killing aliens and stuff. So that's all I have to go off of. We're going to Mars, Super Earth Control. Oh, we get to name our ship? Ooh. <laughs> you can pick Sentinel. <laughs> Yes, I would be a sentinel. Can we choose sentinel of disgrace? <laughs> sentinel of determination. That'd be like a hardcore camper. Sentinel of family values. <laughs> we got the whole family camping. Oh my God. I love this game already. Oh, I want to be a princess of war. That, that <laughs> sounds like me. <laughs> Is there a merc? Oh, there's no mercenaries. No, that would have been the obvious choice. Maybe we can find veteran. Find it. No, there's no veteran. Okay. So there's no mercs. There's no veterans from the US, US merc. merc. We got to find something. Don't even say it. That joke died many years ago. Father of the people. That seems pretty, uh, pretty disgusting. Let's go with that. Our ship is father of the people. <laughs> okay. Going to the bridge. Going to the bridge. The automatons, you say? <laughs> Use the war table to travel to a war front. Got you. All right, time to go to war, soldier. Welcome to the Galactic War. Okay, so Super Earth is safe. I love that it's called Super Earth. Fuck regular Earth. We need to be Super Earth, the earthiest of all. Okay, so this area is 100% liberated. How does this work? Wait, we go to different sectors and liberate the area? I'm so confused. I really have no idea what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> Wait, is this how many people are in the server? Are there 98,000 people currently liberating this area? We gotta go. That sounds sick. Well, obviously, we need to go to Hinga Dinga Dorgan. This is gonna be the first planet we liberate. We gotta save Durgan. We have to kill the automatons. All oh, this poor little guy. All right, I'm ready to go on my first op. Select a mission and get ready to dive. Infiltrate the automaton territory and destroy their fuel and munition stockpiles. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Let's go. This place is gonna take 40 minutes and we're, we're gonna FTL jump. Oh boy. All right, we just fucking twat losered our way all the way out to Durgan. This is so interesting so far. Like, this game is so unique looking, man. Enter a hell pod to start the mission. Okay, yeah, I got you. I think, right? Wait, aborted? No. No, I want to do the mission. What's happening? How do I go? I'm ready to go. Put me in, coach. I'm ready to play. Oh, we actually go into the pod. Oh my god, this is sick. Okay, that's what we had to do. My bad. <laughs> Try to avoid dangerous locations. Oh my god, where are we dropping, boys? This is actually so cool. That's the extraction zone. I, I don't think we need to go there. Maybe we should drop out somewhere safe-ish. I'm thinking like here. That seems good. So maybe we'll go with like an offensive one first. Then maybe a supply one. Okay, I think I sort of get how the stratagem things work. For weapons, we should be fine. Because I don't think we have anything other than like default weapons for now. So yeah, we should be good to go. This game is sick so far, man. Like, how have I not played this? I feel so stupid for not getting on this sooner. Oh, you can actually maneuver the... Okay. 
I was a little late to maneuver it, but <laughs> we just rise out of the water like a Navy SEAL. Love it. Okay, we got to bring up the map view. There we go. This is looking amazing so far, man. Also, one of my buddies that plays this game, he was telling me that you go into this solo, but other people can actually just randomly join in, apparently. At least I hope so. I mean, I'd, I'd definitely like some help from some random people because they most likely know what they're doing. Well, I kind of don't. Okay, so I think this is where we need to be. I think this is our first objective. Destroy the fuel reserves. Okay, wait, can I just like airstrike this? All right, I got the orbital strike. I should be able to bomb this area. Take that, fuel reserves. I really hope this works. There we go. Boom. I don't know if that was a waste of my stratagem. Oh, it's on cooldown. Okay, we're good. Oh, no, the robots are checking it out. Uh-oh. <laughs> don't mind me. Just destroying your fuel reserves. <laughs> Run up on me. See what happens, you dumb robots. <laughs> You're dead. You better not get reinforcements, I swear. I don't want to fight the supply drop robot. <laughs> Okay, so maybe we shouldn't be panic reloading because it'll get rid of the whole mag. I didn't need to airstrike this thing. That meant nothing. The fuel reserves are actually over here. I'm a genius. Crouch. Hide. Yes, it already know it knows I want to call in another airstrike. Let's go. Wait, oh shit. How did you hear me? I was perfectly hidden. Tweet, tweet. I need to like bind dive to something on my mouse. Make it a little bit easier to use. But yeah, we have the airstrike. Oh, you're done. Airstrike him. Come on. Wait, did it just bounce? It bounced out, I think. Oh god, not the physics. Why did the physics betray me? Come on, blow this place up. Boom! I don't... No, that didn't work. It was like close, but not quite good enough. Oh, dear lord. Oh, shit! There's so many coming after me. Oh, dear. Reload it. Reload, 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 reload! <laughs> no! All right. It's okay. We're chilling. We're doing good. There's a giant army of robots chasing after me. Oh, my God! Holy lord. Oh, they're behind me, too. Jesus Christ. I got the whole planet after me right now. What do we do, boys? Look at that. That is very bad. Yeah, can I call in reinforcements? I'm gonna need the SOS beacon, please. Send it out in SOS. Ah! ah, they're getting close. Okay. Oh, okay, I see. So it raises the mission priority. Increases the odds of others joining your squad. Okay, that's sick. Yeah, I'd love to have some other people come in here and help, please. We must liberate Durgan. Oh, that's my last reload. Oh, sh yeah, we need to call in a resupply. Stat, there we go. God, this game is so tactical. It's amazing. It's super tactical. Dude, I wonder if you can get crushed by your own drops. That would be embarrassing. I could never. All right, we have another airstrike. I think we might have killed most of the robots. Wait, no, there's still more. Good lord. Hey, you want to die there, buddy? Thank you. We need to actually destroy the silo. I'm going to drop it right there. I, I still somehow missed. This better destroy one of them. I'm going to be very upset. Oh. I... Did that not destroy it? I'm sure you can blow these things up. I, I should probably get away from that. How do I actually destroy the silos, though? I can hear the robots. They're coming. Screw you. Die. Oh, more than... Nope. I, I gotta stop panic reloading. Okay, we're good. We're good. All right, we have another airstrike. I'm gonna put it right here. There we go. That's, that seems close enough. Why am I stuck in first person? Oh, God. Blow it up. I'm stuck in first person right now. Okay, there we go. Also, that did not destroy it. Why isn't it getting destroyed? <laughs> I'm clearly missing something here, dude. Wait, find and collect samples. Oh, yeah. Okay, we got a common sample. Neat. I only have 30 minutes. No! Maybe I should try destroying this thing. I really don't know. It's gonna kill this guy. That's for... Oh, okay, yeah. Wait, oh my god. That was sick. Dude, that explosion was badass. So maybe I'm just throwing these wrong. I don't know. I need to look at the map and see what else we need to do. Maybe we could go over there and destroy the stockpile to ammunition or whatever. So far, this first mission doesn't seem too bad. I just don't know what I'm doing. I mean, it's my first time ever playing. Okay, I think we're starting to get closer to the stockpile to ammo. Are we getting there? Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, there's a bunch of robots. Give me that machine gun. Oh, my God. Wait, they're behind turrets. It's okay. We got the portable turret. Yo, I like that you're actually slowed down if you're going through the brush. That's a really good attention to detail. This game is awesome so far, man. Like, holy shit. Oh, my God. We're going to the mother load. No more resupplies for you, robots. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit! I don't know what they did. I didn't know that they had those kinds of powers. Oh, God. Yeah, he's just standing out there. Oh, we gotta reload. No, no, no. Oh, I forgot you can't move while you're reloading this thing. Yeah, being out in the open. That's a good spot to do it. All right. We're back. Gotta be careful with this thing. It's very good, but it's also very punishing if you're just out in the open. All right. I'm not sure what the respawn location... Oh, there's another grenade. Dive! We are hell divers. We should dive away from hell. I've got another orbital strike. I'm gonna throw it there. Stop spawning these freaks. Oh, you are so done. 
Oh my god! Okay, we destroyed one of them. So maybe the ammunition stockpiles are just the things that keep respawning the robots. I don't know if we have to keep calling airstrikes. I'm gonna try throwing a grenade, too. Maybe that'll work? I don't know. That didn't seem to work. Now, I remember in the tutorial, if you throw it while the door's open, it might be able to destroy it, but I'm not too sure. Is that one of the stockpiles? I'm just gonna keep throwing shit. I don't know. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, it worked! Okay, that's sick. Wait, oh, it's spawning more of them. Uh-oh. This game is fucking awesome! I love it! I feel so tactical. Wait, I could have called in a hell bomb this whole time? Okay, we definitely need to use the hell bomb at that last section where I was really struggling. I just, I don't know if we can do it with just grenades. Maybe. Oh, wait. I threw it into a hole right there. That should hopefully kill it. Yes. Ooh! <laughs> oh, we got the common sample. Nice. That's good. Oh, that's a lot of robots. Get on the turret. <laughs> ah! No, he got through. Uh-oh. This is bad. We need to get off the turret because he's going to flank us. Yep, there we go. All right, back on the turret. Wait, we're dying. Uh-oh. I'm not gonna lose here. Come on, the turret's good, right? We have stims. Let's go ahead and do that. I remember how to do that, yes. Oh, maybe it's this ammo thingy right here. All right, so I'm guessing chucking a grenade should probably just take care of that, and we should be good. Yep, there we go. Oh my. <laughs> blew myself up. All right, not too bad. So we just have to go back to the other place and I'm gonna call in the hell bomb. Now, I don't know how big of an explosion this is gonna cause. Okay, we only have 21 minutes. We gotta figure out how to destroy these things. Oh, what, what? Huh? Oh, okay. I, I'm back to life. That was horrifying. I didn't realize that they had mines. Okay, I've got, to, I've got to be more careful. I'm being like very careful about where I step now. I think we're good though. I'm kind of horrified about what's gonna happen here, but let's just let's throw it there, and let's run away now. <laughs> oh god, what is this gonna do? I feel like I'm gonna die. I feel like this is the end of me right here. Here comes the hell bomb. Oh boy. Wait, nothing happened? I'm so con- Oh, there's robots coming now. Wait, is it on a timer? Oh, you have to activate it. Oh my god. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, I see. This is gonna be massive. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. I'm trying to get like behind it. I want to see what happens, obviously, but- Oh my! <laughs> Okay, yeah, the hell bomb is awesome. Jesus Christ. Okay, we can extract. Now we gotta get out of here. And it's pretty close to- Oh, it's literally right here. Okay. We have to go to the extraction beacon. Wait, there's a sample here. We got the common sample. Excellent. Now, in fairness, I'm not sure if you can explore the rest of the planet and try to find some rare stuff. I don't know exactly how that works, but I think I'm ready to get out of here. Left, up, right, right, down, down, right, right, left, left. I- Okay, that was terrible. We have to wait two minutes to extract, and there's robots coming. That's great. I think he threw a grenade. Oh, there's a whole ship coming. Well, we might want to get an orbital strike ready then. Take that, idiots. Orbital strike him. Uh, it's a little slow. I don't know if that's going to have any impact. Oh, no, it helped. <laughs> Reloading. More robots. You know, not too bad. You know, I'm wondering if this game is going to get even more difficult as we progress. Like, I wonder if there's going to be different enemy types. Oh, shit. No. Reload it. All right. I've got some downtime. Hopefully, they don't, they don't kill me. Oh, God. Grenade. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're chilling. That should be like the last robot that tries to kill us. Here we go. The ship's here. Nice. All right, sick, sick. The shuttle is here. We did it, boys. We did our first successful mission. Let's go. Woo! I wouldn't be surprised if this game gets progressively more difficult because that was just our first mission. It wasn't too bad. I think I did decent, but we definitely wasted a lot of time trying to figure out how to do it. But hey, I got five stars. Glorious victory. And I got whatever that thing was. I don't know what the R is. I don't know. I don't know what a lot of this stuff is, but oh, we leveled up. Squad impact. <laughs> I don't think we made that much of a dent on the whole Durgan thing. But yeah, man, I really like the idea and the concept of this game so far. I can see why so many people are saying a lot of good things about it. Oh, we unlocked a new difficulty. So we just unlocked easy. So whatever we did before, that was puny compared to whatever else this game has to offer. That's good to know. I want it to be more challenging. I want it to get more difficult. Wait, what are acquisitions? Oh, is this like the store? Oh, I see. <laughs> they have a super store. Well, I guess, I mean, almost everything's called super in this game. Are these actual item <laughs> reviews? <laughs> so easy to use. Even my grandma loves it. Thank you, knitting is cool. One, one. One, recommended by nine out of ten dentists. This has to be fake. Like, I, I think the devs came up with some goofy reviews or something. There's no way. Wait a second. This one's got a one-star review. It says review under investigation for treason. 
Yeah, this has to just be like satire or something. I gotta say the self-awareness of this game is just amazing. Like it makes it even better. Our cape looks so good too. I don't know if it's just because I'm playing on like the biggest field of view, but it looks so badass. Yeah, I'm really digging this game so far, man. But that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me play Helldivers 2 for the first time. If you guys did enjoy this video and you want to see some more Helldivers 2 or some other random games, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later. Come. Thank you.